So then I'm going to show you how to use this external sound card on a Raspberry Pi Zero. The first thing you want to do is have your Raspberry Pi on and have SSH enabled. But since I've already done that, I'm just going to log into my Raspberry Pi and show you how to configure it. The first thing you want to do is to disable the onboard sound card. I already disabled it a while ago and this is the stuff that you need. I'm gonna have this in the description just right here and after you disable the sound card you're gonna have to save it and after save it and reboot okay so now that we're back what we're going to do is to make sure that we can see it and it's just this command a play dash l and now that we can see that we only have one usb device for the sound since we disabled the onboard sound card and now since raspberry pi zero doesn't have any sound yet we have a test sound right here and it's basically just used for testing the sound Front, left. And you can hear that every five seconds it's going to repeat this Front, left. loop. And to turn it up, I usually just Front, exit out an e a terminal. There you go. And then from here, we're going to install uh, MPG321 since all of the other ones that I've tried. It's the one that could access the USB sound. OMX player doesn't work. And while that's installing, we're gonna open another instance of terminal so that we can control the audio. So next thing we're going to do, I already have a sound on my desktop, so I'm just going to go to my desktop. Press tab to autocomplete. And from here, we're going to use MPG321 and then name of the song. I uh, just press tab again to autocomplete. I have to open two terminals just to control the sound because while the term one terminal is playing the sound, I can't do anything with it, so I have to use the awesome mixer to control the sound. That's it. 